Hey everybody, Josh here at Blue Coats Academy. How's everybody doing today? So check it out. I got a great idea from a veteran on, I think he posted like a TikTok or whatnot, about a uh, thing he started up called Veteran Overwatch, where he's going out there and uh, providing Overwatch for the schools and make sure that no one's doing anything stupid. Uh, he's, and you know, and to respond, God forbid, some asshole tries to come up and, you know, start shooting up the place. Well, I'm officially starting off something in Randolph County, North Carolina, called Operation Citizen Overwatch. And uh, it's the same type of deal. We're, we will be looking to our veterans. We will be looking to our uh, to pretty much any volunteer that's ready, willing, and able to donate their time to protecting the, the safety and sanctity of our schools and children. Um, so if you want to know more, hit me back in the comment section below. Uh, you can also catch me on, on my, at my email at bluecoatsacademy03 at gmail.com. And uh, yeah, if you want to know more about it, let me know in the comment section below. Like, subscribe, share, do all the things. And um, yeah, I got an appointment with the sheriff already. Talking to uh, Refuge Medical as well about setting it up, setting up some classes in this area to help out the, to work with our local sheriff's department, to work with our local schools, and pretty much anybody who wants to come, you know, learn how to save a life. Um, shout out to Refuge Medical. They are amazing. Uh, TJ, or AKA Bear, you're, you're an amazing dude. Your company is awesome. Uh, shout out to Forrest Stump over at Refuge Medical. Um, his response has been like on point. This 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 person is amazing. Uh, their their reaction time as far as getting back to emails and doing all that and really and getting in touch with their um, customers. Guys, you guys are amazing. Stellar customer service. Keep up the great work. Um, but yeah, we are getting a getting something started in our local community to make the school safer because obviously we cannot rely on. You know, it, it's it's blatantly obvious. We cannot rely on the federal government, state government, or local government to do a darn thing. It's up to us, the citizens. So ultimately, what I'm going to be doing is putting the power back into the hands of our citizenry. Folks, I've said this before and I'll say it again. You, the people, are directly responsible for the safety and well-being of of your youth, of your children. The school is not responsible. The police are not responsible. The fire department, the EMTs, the blah blahs, and every other agency is not responsible. Only you are responsible for making sure that your kids are safe, whether it be in the home or outside the home. I don't care if it's cross down or cross town or down a river. Doesn't matter. You are directly responsible. So the responsibility is going back into your hands where it firmly belongs. No more outsourcing your child's safety because they tell you to or because they ask you to. No, there will be no more outsourcing of anything. How about we're going to start insourcing everything? And with that, we're going to build a stronger community. We're going to build a more polite community. We're going to build a closer, tighter knit community which ultimately is going to create a wonderful place to live. Folks, like, subscribe, share, get this out there. Talk, and I encourage you, talk to your local sheriff's office. Use the resources they already have and just repurpose them for something better. Everybody has the power to do this. All it takes is a few emails and a phone call or two. Everybody can do this. Remember, it's up to us to keep our children safe. It's up to us to make sure that the towns and, and cities we live in are exactly the way they should be. Peaceful and safe. Guys, with that said, I wish everybody a wonderful day. If anybody's working tonight, guys, have a safe night. Don't work so hard, but get the job done. Everybody else, shalom.